Well, hi, all my friends. We are uh, still in the book of Revelations, uh, finished at uh, chapter 20, so I'd like to get going with it. Um, I tried to do a song last night by Sean Colvin. Um, I need to work on the rhythm. Mississippi Dave, thank you so much for that um, uplink. And um, that'll help me a lot to get it to more of the original. Um, but uh, first try, so glad to have done it. I'm glad you still enjoyed it. Um, and it's uh, very valuable for me to hear from another musician um, your your comments and your support and your you know your love. It's just awesome. <laughs> okay, so <clears throat> all right. Uh, get going here with the uh, the reading please do be in prayer before you hear God's word and I saw an angel come down from heaven having the key of the bottomless pit and the great chain in his hand and he laid hold upon the dragon that old serpent which is the devil and Satan and bound him a thousand years cast him into the bottomless pit and shut him up and set a seal upon him that he should deceive the nations no more until a thousand years should be fulfilled. And after that, he must soon be loosened a little season. And I saw thrones, and they sat upon them. The judgment was given unto them. And I saw the souls of them that were beheaded for the witness of Jesus and for the word of God, which had not worshipped the beast, neither his image, nor neither received his mark upon their foreheads or their hands, and lived and reigned with Christ a thousand years. But the rest of the dead lived not again until the thousand years were finished. This is the first resurrection. Blessed and holy is he that hath part in the first resurrection. On such the second death hath no power, but they shall be priests of God and of Christ and shall reign with him a thousand years. And when the thousand years are expired, Satan shall be loosed out of his prison and shall go out to deceive the nations which are in the four quarters of the earth, Gog and Magog, to gather them together to battle, the number of whom is as the sands of the sea. And they that went up on the breadth of the earth and compassed the camp of the saints about in beloved city, and the fire came down from God out of heaven and devoured them. And the devil that deceived them was cast into the lake of fire and brimstone where the beast and the false prophet are and shall be tormented day and night forever and ever and i saw him a great wa uh sorry i saw a great white throne him that sat on it from whose face was the, from from whose face the earth and heaven fled away and there was found no place for them <clears throat> I saw the dead, small and great, stand before God. The books were opened. Another book was opened, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged out of those things which were written in the books according to their works. And the sea gave up the dead which were in it, and the death and hell delivered up on the dead which were in them. And they were judged, every man, according to their works. And the death and hell were cast into and death and hell were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death. Whosoever is not found written in the book of life was cast into the lake of fire. <clears throat> and I saw a new heaven, and I saw a new earth, for the first heaven and the first earth were passed away, and there was no more sea. I saw John with the holy city, New Jerusalem, coming down from God out of heaven, prepared as a bride adorned for her husband. And I heard a great voice out of heaven saying, Behold, the tabernacle of God is with men, and he that dwell with them, they shall be his people, and God himself shall be with them and be their God. And God shall wipe away all the tears from their eyes, and there shall be no more death, neither sorrow nor crying, neither shall there be any more pain, for the former things are passed away. And he that sat upon the throne said, Behold, I make all things new. And he said unto me, Write, for these words are true and faithful. And he said unto me, It is done. I am the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. I will give unto him that is the Arthurs of the fountain of the waters of life freely. 
<clears throat> Let me see that again. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. He that overcometh shall inherit all things, and I will be his God, and he shall be my son. But the fearful and unbelieving and the abominable, the murderers, horror, mongers, sorcerers, idolaters, all liars, shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is in the second death. There came upon me one of the seven angels, which had the seven vials full of seven last plagues, and talked with me, saying, Come hither, I will show thee the bride and the lamb's wife. And he carried me away in the spirit to a great and high mountain, and showed me that great city, the holy Jerusalem, descending out of heaven from God, having the glory of God and all of her light, which was like unto the most, unto a stone the most pre precious, even like a jasper stone, stone, clear as crystal, had a wall high, had twelve gates. The gates had twelve angels, and names written thereon, which are the names of the twelve tribes of the children of Israel. On the east, three gates. On the north, three gates. On the south, three gates. On the west, three gates. In the wall of the city, twelve foundations, and in them names of twelve apostles of the Lamb. He that talked with me had golden reed to measure the city, the gates thereof, and the wall thereof. And the city lieth four square, and the length is large as the breadth, and the measure of the city, which read twelve thousand furlongs, the length and breadth and the height of it are equal. And he measured the wall thereof an hundred and forty four cubits, according to the measure of man that is of an angel. And the building of the wall of it is jasper, and the city was pure gold like unto clear glass. And the foundations of the wall of the city were garnished with manner of precious stone. The first foundation was jasper, the second sapphire, the third a chalice, chalice uh, oni, the fourth an emerald, the fifth sardonyx, the sixth sardis, the seventh crystallite, the eighth beryl, the ninth topaz, the tenth chrysophrasus, <laughs> okay, the eleventh janet, twelfth amethyst, the twelfth gates were twelve pearls, every single gate was of one pearl, the street of the city was pure gold, and it was transparent glass. I saw no temple there, for the Lord God Almighty and the Lamb are the temple of it. And the city had no need of sun, neither the moon to shine in it. For the glory of God did light it, and the Lamb is the light thereof. The nations of them that are saved shall walk in the light of it. And the kings <clears throat> of the earth do bring their glory and honor unto it. The gates of it shall be shut at all by day, for there shall be no night. And there shall bring the glory and honor of the nations unto it. And there shall in no wise enter into it anything that defileth neither whatsoever worketh abomination or maketh a lie, but they which are written in the Lamb's book of life. And he showed me a pure river of water, a life clear as crystal, proceeding out of the throne of God and of the Lamb. In the midst of the street of it, either side of the river, there was a tree of life, which bare twelve manner of fruits, yielded her fruit every month, and the leaves of the tree were for the healing of the nations and there shall be no more curse but the throne of God and the lamb shall be in it and his servants shall serve him and they shall see his face and his name shall be in their foreheads and there shall be no night there there's no need no of candle or light of sun for the Lord God giveth them light and they shall reign forever and ever and he said unto me, These are the sayings that are faithful and true. The Lord God of the holy prophets sent his angel to show unto the servants the things which must shortly be done. Behold, I come quickly. Blessed is he that keepeth the sayings of the prophecy of, his book, of this book. And I saw John and these things and heard them. And when I had heard and seen, I fell down to worship before the feet of the angel, which showed me these things. Then saith he unto me, See that thou do it not, for I am thy fellow servant, and thy brethren, and the prophets, and of them which keep the saying of this book, worship God, 
And he said unto me, Seal not the sayings of the prophet of this book, for the time is at hand. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. He which is filthy, let him be filthy still. For he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. And behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me, to give every man according to his works shall be. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last. Blessed are they that do his commandments, that they may have the right to the tree of life and may enter in through the gates of the city. For without are dogs and sorcerers and whoremongers and murderers, idolaters, and whoever loveth and maketh a lie. I, Jesus, have sent mine angels to testify unto you these things in churches. I am the root of the offspring of David and the bright and morning star. And the spirit of the bride came, say, come, and let him hear it say, come, and let him that is a thirst come, and whoever will let him take the water of life freely. For I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book, if any man shall add unto these things, God shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book. If any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, God shall take away his part out of the book of life and out of the holy city from the things that are written in this book. He that testify these things saith, Surely I come quickly. Amen. Even so, come, Lord Jesus. The grace of, of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. Amen. <clears throat> that is the ending of the reading of our Bible. Again, it took me a year and almost a, a month and a month and a half. I, you know, not quite two months. So uh, again, thank you, Thomas. And um, we'll be starting some new things uh, uh, on the on the channel. Let's still keep the music going, um, but um, so <clears throat> if you have any comments or suggestions that you'd like to see done. Um, let me know. I'll, I'll take them to, into consideration. And uh, I'd like to introduce you into um, some more Swedenberg. Um, hopefully you'll be interested in that. Um, again, I'm sure that you'll let me know. Um, and uh, I hope that this reading was a blessing to you. Uh, happy Thursday to everyone. Um, and uh, hopefully the fires are out. Uh, I haven't heard anything yet. So uh, maybe later on I'll know uh, as I take my drive to work. I'll probably see what's going on. Um, yeah, so that's it. <laughs> Accomplishment, yay! <laughs> okay, I love you guys. Take care. Talk to you soon. Bye.